Lindsay Vaughan looking for World Cup win number 78 today. And it's a distinct possibility. And she's leading the field. Oh, no, she's in trouble. Oh, goodness me. Oh, Lindsay Vaughan hit the bee netting hard. Seven athletes from the US women's ski team are poised to race today, each hoping for big results. All the products of intense work, study, and training. Schifrin, following some promising Super G results last season, has decided to tackle World Cup downhill. Has never scored points in a World Cup downhill before, so we are excited to see Michaela Schifrin in Lake Louise. While Michaela explores new territory, veteran Lindsay Vaughn knows all about these events. Lindsay Vaughn chasing history. The history she's chasing is that she wants to become the most successful alpine ski racer of all time in terms of World Cup wins. Nothing is sharper, the light. Everything's lit up, fly low, tighten the screws, and let it rip. Finally, it's time for the first downhill of the season. For Michaela, the moment she's been gearing toward is right in front of her eyes. Michaela Schifrin could really mix things up here. It's better for me when I'm thinking the whole time, like, it's not enough. That's when I normally am fast. Schifrin is absolutely rocking it here. Can she put the USA into top position? Oh, yes. Schifrin can do it in downhill. But Michaela's astounding time is eclipsed as Tina Weirider and Connie Huter push her into third. Lindsey Vaughn then commands the stage. And from the outset, she looks to have regained top form. Vaughn is absolutely tearing down the track here. Oh, no, she's in trouble. Oh, goodness me! The brutal crash feels unreal, cruel. The queen of Lake Louise taken out of a race that she had so often dominated. Luckily, she seems uninjured. For the U.S. women's team as a whole, the first downhill brings great pride, with four placing in the top 11. But the biggest story belongs to Michaela Schifrin, whose brilliant run proves enough for a podium spot and adds to her legend. In third place, representing the USA, Michaela Schifrin.